Hey everyone, it's Denise Onofre, your relationship strategist, and we are going to pick up in the workbook part two, Clarity to Connect, in this week's video. If you haven't already downloaded parts one, Calm to Connect, and parts two, well part two, uh, Clarity to Connect uh, of the workbook, head to my website www.myrelationshipstrategist.com, give me your first name and your email address, and I will send you part one and part two of the workbook. Part two and, or I'm sorry, ooh, my numbers. It's a good thing I'm not an accountant. Parts three and four uh, will be released later this year. In those topic areas, part three will be relationships and part four will be sex. Uh, so get out parts one and part two. I'm on page 14 of part two, Clarity to Connect. And I want to, now that we've identified our emotions, we've played around with the emotions word list. Everyone printed them out and gave them to their friends and family and put them on refrigerators. Now that we've identified the emotions, I want to dive a little bit deeper um, into the emotions so that you are more clear with yourself on what's happening with you uh, when you feel um, specific emotions so that you can make your relationships easier and more connected. I feel as if uh, we need clarity in our relationship with ourselves in order to have much easier and more connected relationships. We can't just turn to another and hope that it works out like a Disney movie. We have to work at it. And that starts with a lot of relationship uh, strategies and work with ourselves. So the emotion I've chosen um, to explore a little bit um, today with you on the video that you will find in the workbook um, is inadequacy. And so for each emotion that are on like pages 13 through 16, I'm guessing, um, I've chosen an emotion. And then there are seven questions to go with each emotion. And I won't list them all off today. Um, I like to keep these videos short. I do want to inspire you to go to the workbook and work through these things yourself so that you are getting more clarity with yourself so that when you turn toward, toward another, you can better articulate where you are emotionally, what happens to you emotionally when you're feeling um, certain, certain emotions, what thoughts come up for you, how you feel, and going back to a previous video, what you might need based on those emotions. So this week I wanna talk about inadequacy, but I, all, I kind of feel like this video is already getting a little too long. Um, so just do that. Go to the website, uh, www.myrelationshipstrategist.com and enter your name and your email address and I will get you parts one and part two of the workbook. Head over to page 13, 14-ish and start working through the seven questions that go with each emotion that I've chosen for you to work on. And if you don't already have the emotions word list, you'll find that in the workbook too. All right, have a good week, everyone. I wanna keep them short and sweet. Head to the website. See you next time.